Andrew, that was a real back and forth end to end derby. Yeah, what are the thoughts after uh, finishing with the points shared? It's disappointing really because you know set pieces have been on Achilles heel and today was was no different. We did we did ever so well to get back into the game with um, maybe a bit of luck with the first goal, but with this wind, if you put the ball between the posts, you know it was a, it was a hard conditions to play in and um, caused problems and. Obviously, they, they took the lead of a penalty, which I personally didn't think was a penalty. I'm not going to go to the ref, but he's made a decision. But um, yeah, and then he was an end-to-end game. Yeah, yeah. It was a good, I imagine as a neutral watching it, it was um, a great game to watch because it was end-to-end. Like you say, the reality is we're ultimately denied victory by uh, conceding from a, a set piece. It's yeah. a frustrating one to take, especially so late in the game. Yeah, of course it is, but. You know, we can beat ourselves up with our sort of lack of our, our goals considered set pieces is not is not good enough. But again, I think the ball in was absolutely tremendous. You know, we, we're doing a different sort of system now, marking, and I think he just got he just got in front of his man and headed it across goal. And I, I thought the guy was offside, but I'm, I'm told he wasn't. Who tapped it in? So. There was plenty of positives to take from this game. There was some really you know, superb attacking football and, and really good early signs under Stuart yeah. Gray since he came in. Of course, I mean, Stuart, um, he knows his stuff. You know, he's come in and he's been very straight to the point. And I'm sure he'll be he'll be very frustrated while we give, give the game away. But he's a positive guy and he's been um, saying positive things. And we've just got to move on now. And, you know, I, I think Brentford are a, a really good side. You can tell they've played together a while and, you know, maybe on... On reflection, it draws probably a fair result. And another thing to take away, going a goal down and coming back the way we did, that showed real good character to, to get 2-1 in front. Yeah, of course it is, but I mean, you know, that's that's what I was telling the boys. I was telling the boys that it was, um, you know, it was a penalty, don't get your head down. It's, it's, it's not a, it was out of our hands really, it wasn't a penalty, he gave it. Just move on, and we did, we did really well. We'll have to move on pretty quickly with Ipswich coming over here on Tuesday night. It's a recovery day and then one day of preparation, I imagine. Yeah, of course, we're in tomorrow, as always, if we've got to choose the game and, um, you know, get the lads recovered and hopefully we can, we'll, we'll be in for a different game against Ipswich, that's for sure, but hopefully we can stand up to them and get a win. Thanks for your time, Andy. Well played.